एवरीवन दिस इज द सबा मैम आई ऑल हार्टली वेलकम आई एम प्यारे बच्चे एंड ऑल रिस्पेक्टफुल पेरेंट्स एंड गार्डियन सो माय डियर चिल्ड्रन वेलकम टू टुडेस इंग्लिश क्लास वेलकम टू द वर्ल्ड ऑफ अल्फाबेट्स यस माय डियर चिल्ड्रन एज वी ऑल नो वी आर वर्किंग ऑन यूजिंग दिस एंड दैट एंड टुडे माय डियर चिल्ड्रन इन द क्लास आई टुक द टॉपिक use of this so what is today's topic use of this let me recapitulate your previous classes this the thumb t h i s this this means ye in hindi we say ye the same in english we say this 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 t h a t that that is t h a when you talk about that T H A T that that means wow means wow but today we work here today we work on this and my dear children you will be so happy to know that from today we are also you are also not me you are also going to learn how to write the sentences and I am going to tell you how to write a sentence what are the rules for writing any sentence ready hmm before that. and this and whenever the things are near to us jo cheeze hamare paas hongi that time we will say this for example my pen is near to me i will say this is a pen this is a paper and and you know my tv is away from me i will say that that is a tv so there i am using the term that so and i i understand you are all not babies you may not able to recognize whether they in the objects are drawn we are going to use this or that term that term so today i am going to give you some small bit of idea how to recognize whether to use the this or that term is very easy suppose i write a sentence uh, after that i am going to teach how to write a sentence suppose i write write this suppose a ball is drawn here this ball is near to me i am just giving the example so the ball is near to you i will write this t h i s this i s is a ball and now full stop This is your sentence. This is a ball. So, so here I am using the term this because the our ball is just near to me. Suppose our ball moves away from me. बहुत दूर चली गई है. And our ball is away from me. I will write here. Now see here. Ball is away from me. I will write T H A T that. I will write that. That is a ball. And my dear children, wherever you find this arrow, yes, you will get the idea that there you are going to use the term that. जहाँ पे आपको ये arrow दिख जाए समझ लीजिए वो चीज़ आपसे दूर है और कौन सा term use करेंगे that. Okay, so this is. the small bit of idea how you are going to recognize where to write this and that so this uh, some small intro and now what we had in the class today i went for writing all the sentences comprising of using this aaj humne likha this ke upar pura for example and now i am going to give you idea and what are the rules To write any sentence. So today, for today, you are going to write sentences. So get ready. For example, I'm just giving example. For example, there is a picture of bat. Okay, and your back is near near to you. Yes, you are right. You are going to use the term this. You are going to use the term this. And my dear children. What exactly sentence mean? Mean sentence means wa ke. All the when all the words comprises 
and becomes in a line and they gives a particular meaning that becomes a sentence for example what are you doing this is what is a word are is a word you is a word doing itself is a word these are four words and they are comprised of a different words together and giving a meaning and what will be the meaning in hindi aap kya kar rahe hain hai na to ek sentence hum kaise aapas mein baat karte we talk to each other in sentences and whenever any sentences get completed we say full stop we write full stop jaise sentence complete hota hai hum log kya likhte hain full stop likhte hain and for starting in every sentence the first words फर्स्ट अल्फाबेट इज ऑलवेज कैपिटल हमेशा याद रखेगा कभी भी कोई भी सेंटेंस लिखा जाता है उसका फर्स्ट वर्ड कैपिटल होता है सो अवर सेंटेंस विल बी अवर बैट इज नियर सो यू विल राइट द सेंटेंस दिस इज अ बैट एंड माई डियर चिल्ड्रन फ्रॉम नाउ ट्राई टू यूज खर्सिव राइटिंग एंड ट्राई टू ज्वाइन अल्फाबेट्स एंड राइट ए वर्ड सो दिस इज द वर्ड के एच I yes this you have written this this is a word and after each word always leave one finger gap then you write the next word this is next word is is I yes is this is a uh, one finger gap a uh, this is a bat one finger gap b t bat Full stop. Our com sentence is completed, so we will write full stop. So this is your complete sentence, and we are working on the topic this. So just highlight the word this. You can use crayon here. Just go highlight कर दे. Just highlight the word this because we are working on the topic this. Now, again, I want to remind all the rules for writing a sentence. the first rule is each while writing any sentence you should have one finger gap between each word next rule next rule is that the first words first alphabet should be capital in a sentence jab bhi aap sentence likhte hain so us sentence ka jo bhi first word hota hai uska first alphabet hamesha capital hota hai Like here, this is the first word where this T will be capital. Next, next rule is after completing the sentence, always write full stop. You should write full stop, which means you have completed the first sentence and now you are going to move to next sentence. यहाँ पे next full stop हो गया अब आप next sentence को proceed कर सकते हैं. After this, you are going to write next sentence. For example. Let me write one ball, draw a ball, and now you will write. This is a ball. So this way you have done your classwork. Okay, I gave you total four four sentences, four in classwork and four in homework. Now let's see what we did in classwork. What are the sentences? Let me show you. So in class work, you are going to do the same thing. Today's date. Ah, uh, you are going to write today's O C W and you will write the heading use of this and you are going to write the highlight the term this. And these are your sentences. Picture of bat. You will write beside picture of bat. And here we are using the term this. So all our pictures are near to the sentences. So this is a bat. Second sentence. This is a ball. Picture of hut. This is a hut. Picture of pen. This is a pen. Now let's move to our homework. What is today's homework? You write. You are going to do the same thing. You will write today's date. S W. My heading will be same. Use of this. Where you are using. You are going to highlight the term this. And And what are the sentence for your homework? Picture of cat. You will write beside cat. This is a cat. Picture of a net. You will write the sentence. This is a net. 
picture of a thumb you read the sentence this is a thumb picture of a jug beside picture of jug you will write the sentence this is a jug and so after this sentence you will write full stop and next one work it do read page number 78 of your english textbook so my dear children for today only this much keep smiling keep enjoying your studies so do love care share and respect each and every one have a lovely day thank you and love you all